Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on today to share some summer projects that I made and I'm going to start out by showing you the products that I used. This is a Recollections paper pad called Tropic Vacation and this is a little paper pad from Hobby Lobby by the Paper Studio. And then this is an Echo Park 12 by 12 set with lots of pretty um, spring and summer colors and stripes and polka dots. Now I'm going to show you the dies that I used. I used this little box die from Mama Elephant. And I used that little window die right here. This little flower set from Scrap Diva Designs. This tag set from Jillian Vance Designs. I used the larger tag of the two. A rectangular die set from Spellbinders. And then an alley die that I've had for quite some time. And I used the word summer and then this little drink right here, coconut drink. And there are a couple of memory decks um, dies that I use, the little mini memory decks. I used the bow die out of this one and then the actual memory decks die out of this one. And I love the scalloped edge on this one. I used a little envelope set from Scrap Diva Designs and the treat envelope die from My Creative Time. Then I used this little K-cup cover um, die set to cover your K-cup and it goes in this little mini coffee cup holder and then you can put this little insert piece in and it makes your little K-cup fit snug. I also used this Scrap Diva die and this is the one that makes the little chapstick box. And on her website, she had a little video showing you um, how to make it and then showed you that you can use this little um, die from this telephone set to add to the box and make little um, outlines on these little heart cutouts. I also used this little discontinued set from My Creative Time to make some tags. And then I just used these little um, Velcro dots for closures. My first project is this little K-cup holder and it has the little um, insert in there to make it hold the K-cup snug. And I used the little scrap diva flower and I made a dangle with this little um, polka dotted bow from AliExpress and a little satin bow with some bling and then this little uh, whipped cream topping is from um, a silicone mold and clay and I make those in different colors to add to my projects. And my next little project is this little box and I put in some little scrap diva flowers and some little um, crinkle paper and this little frame die that cuts out is stitched around the edges and this is the sweetest little box. It has a scallop edging all the way around all four sides with this little stitching uh, detail right above the scallop and this is the cutest little box die. And then here is my little chapstick box and here's the little gold hearts that I cut out with the telephone die. And I put a little bit of um, seam binding on this. And this is a little goodies holder that I made to go in my purse. And it's just my little emergency goodies for when I have headaches. And I had um, 
been wanting something to um, put in my purse that was cute. Goodies makes a little envelope. Um, you can get it like little stop and goes or um, little gas stations that has the uh, goodies logo on it, but it's about that size. And then this is the little memory decks card where I use the little cup and the little bow. And then this is a little gum holder and I had some Trident gum and I thought it would be cute to just add in here and use this in your purse to hold your gum. It has the little Velcro closure on it. The last project I have to share are my little tags that I made with that little short set or that little stamp um, that's discontinued that had the shorts on it. And on each of the little tags, I added this little two foam on the back. And then I put the uh, little jute twine on and just used miniature clothespins to uh, attach them to the twine and then use pop-up foam to put them on on the tags and here is a second tag and then here is my favorite and I think it's because of this little rose paper here and that is my project share and I hope everybody has a wonderful weekend and thank you for watching